Hello everyone, before this episode of the podcast actually starts, I just want to say that the graphics you're seeing, uh, they were made by Cute Shark, so thank you to him. If you guys want to make a um, <clears throat> banner kind of thing that will be shown in the podcast over all the audio, that'd be great, and send them my way. You can DM them to me on Skype or on Twitter. Either way, I will get them. Uh, yes, yeah, so that'd be really appreciated if you guys want to make art for the podcast. So yeah, hope you enjoy. Hello everyone, welcome to episode 2 of the Pokemon podcast. Uh, I'm Lego Beast, and... Lagoon, what are you listening to? <laughs> what? what? Alright, anyway, uh, I'm joined by two regulars, Ixolok and Lagoon. Uh, John couldn't make it today, but who needs him? Because we have one remarkable guest in Jinko. Uh, we, oh, have, ah! we have Lightning Spark 7. <laughs> yeah, fuck that guy. And we have Jinko. Hello. Alright. Uh, so we have a lot to talk about in today's episode. Uh, I thought we were going to be all done with Sun and Moon stuff, but we're going to talk about that a bit later. But we're going to start off with what we believe the next evolution uh, will be. Uh, so, Ixo, start us off. Ooh. Uh, I honestly think there won't be one. Not, not any new ones. You think nope. they're done? I think they're done until probably next gen, honestly. I think they're gonna have one for every single type eventually. No. You said that faith. Jinko, what do you think? Normal type. The, all right. I don't know. Wait, you mean like a normal type evolution? Yeah. So you think Eevee's just gonna stay normal when it evolves? Yeah, man. That's ridiculous. What would You're it be ridiculous. Called? What, what would it be called? Um. Normal on. <laughs> yeah. It would be called Eevee two. <laughs> like Porygon two. Yeah. Alright, uh, Lagoon, what about you? Okay, I think there might be a fighting Eevee coming out, and it's name's gonna be the famous Grand Pacer Trusteon. What? The, do you see the- wait, Lagoon, repeat that, please? <laughs> the fitness Grand Pacer Trusteon. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> I 100% disagree. And Lightning, what about you? What do you think? Um, there probably will be one. Maybe, like, Bug or something would be cool. I think uh, if we do get another one next gen, it's going to be Poison. Yeah, but I don't think they're ever going to finish because they're going to keep adding new types. I think. Yeah. So, like, I mean, I mean, they added. I have a completely uh, serious note, though. I think the next one's going to be a Dragon type because it's the only special type left. They haven't added any evolution. Yeah, today. true. But uh, I mean, they were pretty fast on adding uh, Sylveon when they introduced Fairy type. Which I, yeah. I mean, I wasn't like too happy about that. It was kind of like. I'd rather, like, you introduce the new type than if you're going to give Eevee a new type. Don't give, like, the most new type. That's kind of stupid. Give it one that, like, everyone wants. Although Sylveon did end up being very good. Yeah, that's true. Especially because of that pixel ability. Yeah. I think Altaria is the only... Mega Altaria is the only one with that. Alright, so, uh, staying on the topic of evolution, um, we're going to talk about... Do we think that there will be any more evolutions for old Pokémon... Uh, or has Mega Evolution kind of taken that over? And what I mean by that is that, if you remember in Gen 4, like, everyone got an Evolution. But, do you... Is that ever going to happen again? Is there ever going to be, like, another time where a bunch of Pokemon are going to get an Evolution? I think there's going to be one more Evolution ever. Do you... Tangrowth is going to evolve into God. No, stop. I mean, Dunsparce, I'm still waiting. <laughs> the, it's it's kind of weird. I kind of want... I really want there to be, like, more evolution, because I loved in Gen 4 when you got Gallade and Weavile and Tangrowth and all that. And then, there hasn't been any more of that, I think. Has there? I don't think so. You want to count the evolutions? that's well, about yeah, it, though. Well, yeah, I don't really count those. And, like, Mega Evolution's kind of taken that over. Yeah. Yeah, the last time they added an evolution was Gen 4, right? Well, Sylveon, if you count that. Oh, well, yeah. And plus, like, the thing is, though, is that, like, I don't even know what I was about to say. I just <laughs> lost. Oh, no, what I was going to say is, do you think they're actually going to, like, add more Megas in Gen 7? Like, I mean, I would more Pokemon I, are? I wouldn't like, doubt it. And if they, they do, they're not going to add as many as they do. They, like, usually they add, like, 20 or something. I'm going to say they're going to add, like, at, like at least 10. I think that's the most they're going to add. Yeah. Because, I mean, is there ever going to be a time where every Pokemon is going to have a Mega? I don't Probably I, not. I there's no way. Cause could you ever see Mega Sea King being a thing? Yes. You could... Yes. No. I do. Mega Sea King would be cool, dude. All right, yeah. fine. What about? 
What about Mega Mega Kabutops? I can see that. Yeah. God damn it. Okay, okay, then every Pokemon's getting a Mega. Here, <laughs> yeah. here, here first. I don't think they would do Mega Kabutops though. I could see I mean Aerodactyl got one. I could I could see Omni yeah. and Kabutops getting one. Hmm. Speaking but, of Megas, our, we should our, get to our Mega discussion. No, no, that's that's later, dumbass. Alright. Okay. You can't right. just skip topic. Dad. Yeah, jeez. Yeah, right, we were um, talking about Megas. But uh yeah. but, like I was I don't really think that they're gonna give every fossil a mega evolution either. Like nah. um, like Tyrantrum? No, I'm sorry. That thing already looks like a mega Pokemon. Yeah. Alright, anyway. Thinking about it now though, for Impardo, so oh. the Mega would be insane. Oh yeah. That thing's in my that, that, that thing that attacks looks ridiculous. It's 165, I think. Dear lord. The that highest out of any <laughs> non-legendary. That with a mega evolution would just be. Actually, would Trust Band be stronger still, or? Uh, I don't know. I don't think so. I don't know. All right. Well, let's move on to uh, the Sun and Moon news. Um, Lagoon, if you want to start us off with the weird dog in trailer, as you called it. Yeah, there is a weird dog in the trailer. That that's about it. All right. Well, you... you don't really know anything else about it. It they looks like a normal type, though. They only showed the back of it. Jesus. I think, yeah. uh... That Wait, dog, where was that, this? I didn't see this. It was very hidden. You had to pay real close yeah. attention. Here, I'll send you, uh, I'll send you the picture that Lagoon sent me of the dog right now, Jenka. I'll send it to you over, like, Twitter or something. But, um, I do you think that's gonna be, like, the Gen 1, uh, rodent thing, or whatever? Um, or do you think it's just, like, a random dog? I, think it's just I don't know. It might be, like... It might be like a fur fruit type of thing, just a random yeah. dog. Yeah. I think we have too many dogs. Maybe even a filler Pokemon, sadly. Yeah. Woof. <laughs> bork. I sent you uh, the thing, Jinko. Alright. Bork, bork. Right. Uh, so... Yeah, I mean, it's probably gonna be called Woof Woof, if I do yeah, ask. hopefully. I'm, I'm gonna guess Bork Bork, actually. I hope it's a or, dragon type. Or and Mr. Dog. Grass and water as well. Mr. Dragon dog would be a good name. <laughs> I'm gonna catch one whenever Sun and Moon comes out. I'm naming it Mr. Dog. What if its name is already Mr. Dog? And then I'm naming it Dog. <laughs> Mr. How about we move on? All right, yeah. Uh, so, do you guys talk even... about the the? There was a in the original, like Sun and Moon thing. There was the the bird. Oh yeah, that yeah that like yeah, the red we... bird thing. Yeah, let's talk about that while we're on the topic of like that. I've dog. never seen it. Um, in the first ever trailer, Lightning. They like do like a wireframe, like this red bird looking thing. Oh, it that looks like thingy, a, yeah. It, it yeah. looks like that's gonna be the 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 regional bird. bird. Yeah, it's gonna be called strawberry. Yep. I don't think what about cherry? Well they did pretty good with Talonflame, I think. Oh yeah, that thing is yeah, but Talonflame is like a special case. That thing's retarded. <laughs> Talonflame's funny. Gale oh, wings, um, like Jesus Christ. Fun. Except for the low attack stat, though. I mean, yeah. Fun in fact, um. In X and Y, when you're doing a double battle with Serena against Tierno and Trevor, her fletchling is Gale Wings. What? Gotta nice. go fast. Dude, no way. Because it out-prioritized the quick attack that I had, so. The more you know. Alright, anyway. Uh, the next thing is the battle UI. Uh, it looks like, so, as we said last episode, it does look like you're going to be able to see the person you're battling. Oh, that. Which is huh. going to be pretty interesting for all. If they're going to animate every single trainer sprite, and then that's. I think that's going to look really cool for uh, gym leaders, too. That's going to look awesome. And then, uh, also, like, around, it looked like, uh. It looks like there's, like, people watching the battle, too, which is pretty weird. Just the graphics in general are amazing. Yeah, like the, like the little, like, uh, the health bar looks pretty cool, too. It actually looks like I still haven't like, seen it, by the way. Uh, I can, I'll DM it to you on Twitter, or Skype, whichever one works better for you. Well, this, this is in the, the trailer, right? No, uh, Lagoon, well, we're gonna get into, uh, what Lagoon did last night. And Lagoon's famous now, by the way. Oh, uh, is Lagoon, he? Yeah. Dude, Lagoon got a, Lagoon got a shout-out in a Tyranitar Tube episode. Because, oh, man. Because he beat... Uh, Tyranitar Tube into finding what, Lagoon? Um, some cool stuff. Alright, thanks, Lagoon. What'd you find? 
Uh, um, I potentially may have found the final types for the um starters in the um code for the Japanese website. Yeah, and uh, according to what was the found... most recent video. Yeah, it's in his. It's a five minute. If you go five minutes in, you'll just see him say the Lagoon Twenty Two. He's like he beat me That's to glorious. it. Anyway, uh, but according to what Lagoon found, Ravel's gonna keep its grass flying type all the way. Litten is gonna be fire ground, which pisses oh, me off. And <laughs> so that thing's pa- dead. And Poplio is gonna be water fighting. Oh shit! What up? All right, so I'll be, I'll admit, I'll admit, I was a bit harsh on Populo, calling it a water clown type and all that. It still looks like a clown. I still think it's going to be water clown. I don't believe this. Yeah. Or what? Then it could be a physical attacker then. Think about it A now. physical water type again? Yeah, well, it's going to be part fighting then. Yeah. If it is there part fighting. There are special fighting types. Yeah, 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 yeah but there's like only like vacuum wave, and, vacuum wave and uh, focus blast. Uh, that's or all I can a think sphere. Of. Or a sphere, but that's three. Yeah. Ton more physical fighting moves that I could use. Unless they but, add um, more. the one I really want to talk about is how they're really just. They, they really don't want us to, like, Litten, it looks like, because they're making it fire ground. Oh, man. Yeah. If that's it's a unique that type, still, but. Not really. Yeah, but, yeah, but has it, it. Has, it has quad weak to water. It has. What else? What else is it weak to? Ground. Ground. Is ground weak to ground? No, fire. Ground is oh, fire yeah, right, weak to right, ground. Right. What else? Uh. It looks like it has. It's gonna have like a lot of weaknesses. It's gonna be neutral to grass now. Yay! Yeah, which is annoying. Like Jesus Christ! Like this gonna cat is gonna resist suck. Bug, though. Wow! Like I needed the quad resist bug in the first place. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Unless Mega Yon Mega becomes a thing, I don't think so. I'm but check uh, right now, what fire grounds weaknesses are. A lot. But then, uh, the relic out. keeping its grass flying or whatever. That's pretty interesting. Yeah, but that ice type weakness could be an issue, especially oh, yeah. like ice shard and whatever happening mm-hmm. around. Uh, a snowflake would kill it. Yeah. So snowflake. also in the picture, in the picture uh, that Lagoon found, in the one I sent you, Lightning, your rival essentially looks like it looks like he chooses the weaker or like the one that's weak against the one you choose. Oh Which yeah. means that there are potentially three, uh, two rivals again, kind of like in Wait, can you, uh, can you send that to me as well? Yeah, I'll send it to you over. Actually, I'll send it to you over Skype. Uh, Jinka. Um, but potentially you're gonna have two rivals, so Alright. Oh, that's not right. Oopsies. Nice. Either that or Pokemon's giving up on trying to make it hard. I said it's you on Twitter and speaking instead. of that, I hope that like they don't make this game too easy again, like Yeah. X I mean, and Y was a breeze. Same thing with Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire. I found that pretty easy as well. Or if they're gonna make it easy, they should have like a hard mode or whatever. Yeah. Like if Black it... 2, White 2? Yeah. Because that was. That challenge I... mode was difficult. I just think that the experience share is like. I understand why they're doing it, because they want, they want it to appeal more to kids, but obviously it was not happening. It happened in Gen 1, though, that's the thing. Yeah, wasn't it Gen 1 experience share the same thing? See, I think, I so. think I, it wasn't the same thing. I think the experience share should do both. What? In it can either be held on one specific Pokemon to share the XP, or you can just turn it on. Oh, and so have you it have do an all. option. It's just your choice. Okay, that makes yeah. So then, yeah, then that way you have an option of what you want to do. Some of the scrubs that want to, you know, have it on can do that. And then the cool kids that want to just put it on one thing, they can do that. I mean, just looking at the game right now, like, it, it looks like it's going to probably be the same thing. If they're going to keep it, I don't, I don't see why they would, you know, change it to having the experience be on. Then like two gens, then like two games later, be like, nope, we're going to change it back again. It seems a bit like ridiculous. I, I'm pretty sure they've done that before, haven't they? Well, I don't know. What look like a, took like a, a Pokemon Master or something? We're gonna get into how you can be you Pokemon Master later, by the way. Ooh. With... And I think, um... Do they change the battle animations at all? What do you mean? Because like from, from what I saw in the trailer, Litten looked like it was using Ember, and it was like the exact same thing as it was. Oh yeah, no, no, uh, yeah. it was using Ember. Water Gun looks a bit different, and then Rowlet was using a move called Leafy, apparently. Yeah. Which so sounds a new dope. 
Like, I just... Little... The one thing that I hope... Say you used Hydra Pump on, like, a Blastoise, right? It would come out of its mouth instead of, the, the like, its cannons. I hope they fix that. It would oh, come yeah, out really... of its cannons. Come on. No, it did not. Yeah, it, it came would. out of its mouth. But Are you Hydra kidding Pump. me? No. Yep, in Gen 6. It comes out of its mouth. It does, I actually. I remember Don't that. believe you. Hold on. Even, I, I'll look e it up. It e sucks. E even Mega Blast toys, it comes out of its mouth. And plus, you know in Typhlosion, right? They don't, I'm pretty sure Typhlosion doesn't have any fire on its back. Yeah, it doesn't. It only has fire on its back when it uses a move, I think. Yeah, which is, like, dumb. It should always have a fire on its back. Alright, well, let's, um, let's move on to uh, our next topic, which is... Are they going to add... Well, they're obviously going to add new abilities, but what kind of abilities do you think they're going to add next it's gen? It's totally coming out of his mouth. That's BS. But uh, do you guys have any ideas right now for new abilities that you can maybe, see happening? Maybe I have something similar to, like, Pixelate, but for a different type or whatever. Oh, yeah, def I feel like they're going to definitely add a few more of those. I have an idea. What? But it's kind of broken. What is it? Um, it's, well, I mean, it's not really broken, but it's similar to Truant, but only, it, it only affects attacking moves. Oh. What do you mean? So, like, you can still set up all you want, but attacking moves, you would only attack every other turn. I want there to be an ability kind of like pure power or huge power, but it raises special attack. That would be kind of broken some Pokemon, I think. Yeah. Alakazam? Well, I mean, well, I mean Mega Metashim has a uh, huge power, right? Yeah. yeah. And then, but then there could also be a thing for like huge power, pure power that does that for like like the defensive stats as well. I don't know. Uh, either one, really. It it's kind of iffy though. I'm still kind of wondering about the legendary uh, abilities. What they're gonna get? The new I ones. feel like they're gonna get their own. Yeah. yeah. Like I hope just... they don't get pressure. Oh my god, pressure's the stupidest ability. Not a bad ability, really. I don't They're like it. It's really kind of it, it's like a waste, though, in my opinion. See, I feel like it's good on tankier mons like Dusclops. Yeah. Did Dusknoir get pressure? I don't think Dusk it did. It got Frisk and something else. It gets Love pressure. It, it does. Uh, anyway, I can check. You go anyone else? All right, but uh, anyway, no. moving on for a bit. Trying to think of one, but I can't. All right, everybody's. Um, what abilities should certain Pokemon have that they don't have access to? Ooh, I got anything one. Anything that's floating above the ground should be able to get levitate. Mhm. Mm like Klefki. I think Klefki should get levitate. All right, Klefki doesn't deserve to exist. So neither does Meowstic, but no. What Meowstic is cool. Meowstic's horrible. Thank no, you. Nobody likes Meowstic. It's in, like, isn't it? It's in PU for a reason. I love P U. P P U is my favorite tier, so let's yeah, not even know. Yeah, P U is my Shut up. T t lightning, <laughs> watch your tone. Yeah, well, here's the thing. R U is my favorite tier. It's have salt in it. So no, it's not. You love Ubers. That's all you ever do. <laughs> That's true. Dark rise in it. So. Anyway, uh, but <laughs> what other abilities could you see certain Pokemon getting besides levitate? Um. Um, I can see. Deli Bird not having hustle anymore because that's kind of annoying, and Dino too. I'm kind of sick of all the starters having Overgrow Torrent. Yeah. Blaze. Well, I mean, I think they should just keep that because that's been a thing, you know. Yeah. I think it's there for a reason. I don't know. It's kind of silly because like I feel like some of them are broken as hell. But has it ever? Has it ever? I've never noticed that. I've never noticed it like working. Like I've never it, been it like works. it does. It does. It does. I, I don't think it, it, I never. Works. I just. I just never pay attention to it. Yeah, like, I'll be like in a gym battle. Like my like my duo will be at like one HP, and then like it's like Razor Shell will do like I'll do some damage. Like I don't even notice it working. I guess it does work. I just won't even notice it. Yeah, I just it always does. forget about it. it. Does work? Yeah. Is there like a one point three boost? Um, hold on. I, I can think it right is. now. Which is actually decent. Yeah. I think it's uh, one point three. When this Pokemon has one third or less of its max HP, its Grass Water Fire does one point five times. Oh, one point so. five! Yeah, that's extremely good. Yeah. Um, but some of them break the Mon, like um, Blaziken. Yeah, like the reason speed why boost. Blaziken's Ubers now. <laughs> but I feel like if one Pokemon gets it, all of them should. Because I think okay. Meganium only gets it. Yeah, I don't it's think Meganium what? had a no, second ability. No, it gets ability. Leaf Guard. 
I think it's does. Elite Guard, yeah, which is crap. Um, I think I think every starter has two abilities, like one that one which is Blaze or all that, and then one that's like a hidden ability, kind of like yeah. yeah I contrary. think does, does, I think all of them have. What does Sceptile have? have? Doesn't Sceptile have um? Oh my God, what is it called? Unburden. Yeah, Unburden. There you go. Um, does Empoleon have one? Uh, Defiance. Ooh. Oh yeah, I used to use that. What does um? What does Typhlosion have? Um, flash, fire. Flash, fire. flash fire. Oh, and then for alligator probably has sheer force. sheer force. Oh, it does. Oh, I thought it had strong jaw for some reason. Uh, no, it has sheer it force. It should get strong jaw. That makes um, more Samurai sense. Samurai has shell sense. armor. What does um? Or Terra have shell armor or whatever? Probably. Actually, I think. Uh, yeah, I both have. Yeah, that, I get I shell armor. Um, Inferna Infernape has iron fist. Uh. And what a swamp! A swamper gets a damp. What? The... Yeah, fucking damp. <laughs> um, damp. What the hell does Delphox get? Poison gets speed boost, gets and magician. swamper gets damp. That's bullshit. <laughs> what does magician do again? Steals your item or steals your opponent's item if you don't have one. Called Jew. Anyway, what? Uh, all right. So, getting away from abilities. Uh, new moves in Gen Seven. Any ideas for what moves? Uh... I'm waiting, for, like... I'm waiting for uh, I'm waiting for another one hit KO move. I'm waiting yeah. for a stronger dark type move. A what? A stronger dark type move. What would you call it? Would you call it a stronger dark type move? Um, I don't know. It's probably see, like most attacks have their base one twenty. Yeah. Except for dark type, which I think Night Day is the best one for it, which is base eighty five. Uh, what's Hoopa's oh, move? Foul play. Isn't that? Well, foul play is ninety. Space what is Lightning. Hoopa's signature move? Isn't that dark? Hyperspace Hole! Yeah, or Hyperspace, Hyperspace Fury, one of the two. Um, Hyperspace Hole's animation is ridiculous. It's popping out of holes and like, beating the shit out of like Zigzagoon. Oh, yeah, it's base 100. It's base <laughs> okay, yeah, you had to make it a Zigzagoon. I did, I'm sorry. <laughs> anyway. But, uh, I mean, do you, are there any moves that exist now that you're surprised certain Pokemon don't get? Oh, yeah. I'm... I'm gonna go right off the bat and say Garchomp. Why don't you? Why doesn't he get fly? Garchomp has been Garchomp literally is has been flying around for like years. Maybe and... it can't fly across long distances. It can. It can. Yeah, I will read off its its dex entry. Another thing says. Another thing. Why does Right on get surf? That microphone is muted. Is no. Why? Like, why? Microphone activated. There's well, quite a few things that get surf that are. Behem gets Steel Wing as well. It literally says. It well, flies Behem gets at Steel Wing for equal. a reason. That's because they never fixed it, the. uh... Behem 51. Yeah. Because Garchomp gets. It flies at speeds equal to a jet fighter plane. Okay. So he doesn't fly <laughs> okay, long distances. Then. Maybe he just can't <laughs> fly slowly. It never allows its prey to escape. It's, it's Could you imagine literally... if Garchomp got flying, like its trainer sitting on it, it's going at speeds of like a jet plane? Like, Maybe that's why it can't get fly. So you just, Whoa, like, slow down, off. Garchomp! It's well, too fast. Can then why can we find like Latios and Latias? They're moving fast as hell over home. Yeah, Maybe know, Garchomp but... doesn't know how to hell, fly slower. Latios is doing flips while you're in the air, <laughs> and you're perfectly fine. Point. I honestly. I would like to do that again. The flying what? thing. Oh yeah, the, oh, the yeah. Eon flute. <laughs> but do it badass. for Garch. That was like my favorite part. Of... <laughs> no, do it with just a wingle. Oh yeah. Oh just no. Just a wingle. All right. Um. Should we move on. I honestly think that Absol should get earthquake. Or or hurricane or. Or hurricane. It makes sense because the natural disaster thingy. Yeah. And some. Oh yeah, Garchomp should learn Dragon Dance too. I think Pikachu no. should learn Pluck. Why? Because Pikachu's hungry and it wants its. Pretty sure Garchomp gets Dragon Dance. No, it does um, not. It, it does not. It, no, it gets it in Glazed, I think. Yeah, it gets well, it in Glazed. In glazed. Okay, yeah, but is Glazed? Is Glazed? Is glazed yeah, I know. I was playing through Glazed and I got Dragon Dance by level up, and I was like, oh, okay. That's why it doesn't get Dragon Dance. Yeah. Yeah, because it makes. You I say, just kind of oh. like. Killed the entire Elite Four basically with Garchomp. Oh yeah! By the way, I think Slacking should get huge power. Lol. No, no. Oh, dude, one of my um IGN. Spirit should get Wonder Guard. No, Ixo. One time, Stop. I changed my IGN to huge power Slacking. 
I had them. I had them in a randomizer. Proof too. I was playing a randomizer and I randomized abilities and a selecting I had had huge power and it was a jolly nature so it outsped everything and one hit everything. Did like, you did... still lose that? No, I still won. I just somehow lost Pokemon. I, I didn't. I didn't leave the slacking all the time. I was like, hmm, slack. I don't want to make it too easy. And then I lost Bobby the Doug Trio. No, you just solo Bobby. ran with. Yeah, you just solo ran with that, bro. I probably still could have. I probably would have won. But I did win, so that didn't really matter. Anyway, uh, so next topic is one that Ixa wanted to talk about last week, but I told him no. Uh, we're gonna talk about Bitch. Pokemon mistypes. Uh, explain that, Ixa. Um, pretty much some Pokemon, you just look at its type and like, why are you, why? Or, or why are you not? And why are you not, exactly. Like, so, if, I'm gonna defend my Absol forever, so I'm gonna say, it's Mega should have been Dark Fairy. But a lot of people say. It's mainly because of the wings. And, and it looks like a, it should be a Dark Fairy. It, it's like, it learns play rough. I don't understand oh, why. Stab. I don't understand why Gardevoir got the fairy type. I thought that was pretty stupid. They just added a bunch of old. Pokemon. They wanted I, to make it. I think that I think that Gardevoir's Mega should have gotten the fairy, but Gardevoir by itself shouldn't have gotten a fairy typing. I think that was just dumb. I also don't agree with Meryl and Azumarill getting it. Although that made it extremely good, but hey. Yeah. And then, it's a dragon oh, killer. OP. Yeah, literally. Samurai should be water fighter. Yeah, that or, too. or water steel. Ah, uh, water fighting. I don't. Right. Wait, can we? Can we just talk about why? Can we talk about how Aegislash Slash and all them are ghost types? Yeah. I understand that it's a possessed sword, but I mean, that, it's a uh, that sword. would make it a that would make it a ghost then. I don't. Possessed. I don't. I don't like it's how ghost. it's ghost though. It Dude, makes hold it... on. I I have I a reason. Because I think Honage's description, like. I don't know. I feel like that, like, they kind of, like, made it a bit too broken with the ghost steel. Let's see. Oh, no. Speaking of Ego Slash, is there anything that you think that you could ever see getting a stance ah, change? Stance. Jesus Christ, Lightning. You. Bless you. I don't, I don't. I couldn't think of anything that would get stance change. If, if a Scavalier Mega evolves, it'll get stance change. Um, basically... If Kevin anyone Kitar. dares to grab its hilt, it wraps its blue cloth around that person's arm and drains that person's life energy oh, completely. Oh shit, never mind, ghost type, what am I saying? <laughs> <laughs> Dear lord! It's gonna come after you now, now that you said that. Could you imagine, like, ooh, gonna craft an iron sword. No! No, nah, no I... I'm losing hearts, I'm gonna lose! Stop, really. Do a scenario for that. That would be yeah, craft an iron sword and start dying slowly. Every every sword you craft. I mean, okay, so another thing is that people debate on, like, Flygon being a bug type, but I think ground is fine, to be honest. I think if they give it a mega, it should be bug. But then I, again, think dragon, kinda... I think dragon bug would be interesting. Also, yeah. why does Flygon yeah. have levitate? Yeah, mega should be that. Wait, what, it's in the it air? Flygon has levitate, I don't understand Yeah, that. it does. It's in the air. Because it's flying. Yeah, but it, it's dragon ground. I don't... It's flying. Yeah, because it is Flygon. Wings. Oh, I guess it's because it's not the flying type that they just... Yeah. 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 But then, but then as Jinko said earlier, anything that's floating should have levitate, so... But one thing, why does Gengar get it? Levitate? He's he clearly can fly. standing on the ground. Yeah, yeah that's fly. just because the model, but Gengar can fly. He can, like, yeah. Why can't Gengar learn fly? Yeah, Golurk can, why not Gengar? Because when you get on a Gengar, you'll Dude, fall right Golurk through. Is it yours? Go look at the Iron Giant. <laughs> why can't Reggie Steel learn fly? Okay. Exactly. That, that's that's obviously right. answer. Um, if you guys have ever played Pixamon, it might just be me, but when Golurk flies, it looks ridiculous. Like, rockets come out of his ass, and it's fucking hilarious. <laughs> oh, it flies, dude. Looks like the Iron Giant. Love that movie. All right, well, let's go on to the best topic on this list. All right, oh, now. yeah. I've been waiting um, for this. Did you know... That you can become a Pokemon Master for a hundred and sixty dollars plus pay to free win. shipping. <laughs> free shipping. All right, so if you look at this Amazon link that's in the doc or whatever, you'll see that you can buy all the badges, including all ten of the ones from Gen uh, Gen Five, because there were like ten gyms in that one or whatever. Uh, and you can get all for a hundred sixty dollars or whatever. And they're kind of low on stock right now. I think they only have, like, what, like, 18 Four. left? 
They've got four, four left. Four yeah, left. better hurry, guys. So, I can understand buying these separately, but looking at them separately, I mean, like, I think it's still more if you buy them separately. Yeah, it is. I'm I'm definitely gonna think when I get like when I get married or whatever, wait hold on what I'm looking at the the frequently bought together you can yeah. get 144 Pokemon for only 14.98 is there free shipping <laughs> yeah I see that. yes oh no you can also get Mega Man Legacy Collection <gasps> hold on wait no what is Pokemon what Pokemon balls. is that in this Where? picture that which one look like a Pokemon Where? which one they're all miscolored. Oh, wait, uh, wait, wait. wait, Houndour doesn't have a mouth! Where's Houndour? Wait, what? Look at it's that. Right by, it's right by Pikachu. Look at that and look at the fourth picture. God, look at full pics. Look at the fourth <laughs> They're all off color. Are these supposed to be like Gen 1? I mean, I, no, 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 they can't because I see like a slow king in there. God, too. look at the Krabby. The wait, why is there so many Pikachu's? Why is there two Mewtwo's? <laughs> look at Victini! Where's Victini? <laughs> Where's Victini? <laughs> yeah, it's the fourth picture. It's in the front row. Look at the fourth picture. They, none of these are the right color. <laughs> the fuck? Oh, is, these are shinies. This is stu look at Spiro. Why is it red? <laughs> Why does okay, it look like that? Okay, guys, guys. Let's not. Let's not drag into this. Oh, guys, guys. Are you guys, gonna show Look at Absol. Logo? I'm gonna link the Amazons. Or no. What is the thing next to Oddish? Where's Oddish? Jump Woman? No, okay, no, we're gonna we're gonna talk about nicknames a bit later in this. Wait, uh, hold on, hold on. Lightning. Why is Gengar blue? Oh yeah, I saw it. it's shiny. Well, right? It's shiny as blue, so. Guys, the first picture, Jolteon is just cut in half. <laughs> <laughs> Where? Where's Jolteon? First picture, it's on, like towards the middle. All right, so I'm probably gonna link these Amazon uh things in the description if you guys want to look at these. So. I don't even see. Jolteon. I would advise you not to buy these though. <laughs> Yeah, so if you guys have if you guys have some money laying around, you want to be a Pokemon master, get badges and Pokemon. And Pokemon. Miscolor, discol discolored Pokemon, by the way. Why is this four money. stars? I'm gonna add both of these to cart right now. <laughs> oh my god, you can also get a clip and carry Pokeball belt. <laughs> can I get oh, a Pokedex? Man. You can also get a teacher peach stickers, treat classroom stickers, five sheep pack, bully free. Bully free! No one's gonna bully you! <laughs> it's a bully free zone. It's 6 dollars You can't bully me, I have the Fen badge! <laughs> okay, how about let's not go into this? Let's just, uh... Alright, alright, alright. Let's just yeah, get, get a Pokedex playmat? <laughs> <laughs> okay, let, let's, let's not. Right, let's, uh... let's just stop, let's just stop. Alright, so next up we're gonna talk about... What we want to see in Generation 7. Player customization! That's it's already confirmed. It's already confirmed. Sure. Is it? Yep. Yeah. Where? Um, well, you can just tell. Because all the characters are wearing different colors. Yeah. Are they? they were, I, mean, I thought they, they were all the wearing goofy like, hat like, off the girl. But, um, I, I, as we talk, I want the game to be harder. I want that. I want the ability to drive cars. They added... <laughs> Dude, now they, uh, um, they instead, added the instead difference... of keeping a bike in your bag, you keep the car. <laughs> <laughs> they did. They did. No, you, no, you, you just keep, you get a, you get, a you get your little, you get your like phone. You just call an Uber. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they did. They did different skin tones. Now they should add sexuality. <laughs> Dude, I'm a gay Pokemon trainer. What of it? It's like, Tumblr, it's like, Tumblr people are gonna get offended when they don't there's that, that one. There's that one homophobic gym leader where it's like, you can't challenge me because they're gay. <laughs> but I need the bag. Like there's like a homophobic four. nurse, Joy. She's like, I will not heal your Pokemon. No, <laughs> you go to the Mart, like, I kind of 10 Pokeballs. But he's like, yeah, here, but you don't get it. Yeah, but you don't get a Premier Ball because you're black. <laughs> no, it's when your rival, I went to the Pokemart. I buy 10 Pokeballs and he didn't give me a <laughs> Alright, um, what, uh, Lagoon, what do you want to see in Gen 7? Uh, more Pokemon than Gen 6. Well, yeah, I mean. They got Gen 78. Gen 6 was embarrassing. Go, keys. Well, maybe it's because of the, uh, Mega Evolutions. <laughs> oh, yeah, run that's out, true. Like, is, in a way. Like I'll throw my pair of keys at you, I'll throw a cupcake at you. 
I'll throw a fucking ice cream cone at you. I'll this throw a Pokeball at you. That was Gen 1. I'll throw I'll a throw magnet trash at you. I'll throw a I'll horse throw that's a pile on fire of at, at you. you. Or solitaire. I'll throw literally just a pile of Oh yeah, we're purple. gonna get off topic from Pokemon for a second. Horse Solitaire is coming out soon, so pick up your copy. Yeah, dude. <laughs> Or just this episode the... of the Pokemon podcast is brought to you by Horse Solitaire. There you I go. Remember, I remember when the direct for that came out and Jinko Lightning and I were like freaking out over that. Because oh. <laughs> like it's like the directs are so irrelevant. There's like there's like a bunch of irrelevant games and the last thing is all anyone cares Everyone about. Everyone thought it, it was that direct too. Everyone thought they were going to do Pokemon stuff. Yeah. But they oh. didn't and they gave us something better than Pokemon. Yeah, Horse Solitaire. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, we should get your copy. Wait, right. can can I break off into TCG real quick? Sure. No one's gonna listen, but. Well, I got amazing polls. So, I saw those on Twitter. No one gives a shit. If you want to look at uh, Ixos amazing polls, follow him at Ixolux. Follow at Lindenspark7. And yeah, the at... Jolteon is freaking lit. <laughs> at Lindenspark. Lindenspark7. It's lit. Lindenspark. Lit. All right. Um. So we're gonna go oh, on. Man, those are uh, some nice polls. <laughs> Speaking of wow. polls, Pokemon polls. Day sixty one came out today. I voted on it. What'd you vote for? I forget what the vote was, but I voted on it. It was like, well, Crobat's kicking ass right now. Oh yeah, yeah I, I voted, voted for Crobat. Yeah, I told Wait, you to just make a new poll. Um, I'm doing the cross generation evolutions or whatever. I think it was one. I'll look it up. Oh, right I had to log in. Hang on, I'll just stalk Lego's Twitter. Get away from me. Okay, well, anyway, we're gonna move on to. Uh... It's Crobat, Blossom, Polytoad, and Sloking. Cool. Oh, uh, what the hell? We're gonna move on to our uh, our Mega Evolution speculation thing, in which all of us name a Mega Pokemon that we want to see happen. We're gonna give it stats and ability and all that. So, Ixo, oh, we have to do one... stats and ability. Yeah. So just yeah, just... Ixo, why don't you start us off? I'm not gonna say one. I'm gonna say three. Uh, that's not how that works. <laughs> Shut up. I want the Johto starters. All three of them. All three of them. Okay. Jeez, you only want... I want Meganium to be one. more defensive and get a little bit of an attack stat, but drop an attack and speed. Hold on a minute. You want to have more of an attack stat, but drop an attack and speed. Uh, special attack, speed, whatever. Okay. Drop special attack and up attack, lower speed. Okay, what about for alligator? Um, I need to pull up a stats alone. For L, how do you spell true. it? I know it's AIDS. How do you spell for alligator? There we go. Um, more attack, uh, more speed, and just drop defense, special attack, and special defense. Oh, wait, what ability would you give Meganium? Oh, shit. Um,. Probably the thing I said last week with Roserade. Uh, the grass, like, pixelate. Yeah. And then, um, would you give it a new type, or would you just keep it pure grass? Um, I think it should gain a fairy typing in there. Alright, and then what about for Alligator? For Alligator's gonna stay straight up water, he's gonna keep sheer force. Alright. And the stats are gonna be what I just said. And then what about Typhlosion? Typhlosion's gonna become a fire rock type. Oh? Um, he's gonna get a major special attack and def and uh speed boost, and just okay. a little bit of spit f in there. Okay. Is that it? Yep. And then, do you say its ability? Um. That's. I don't know. Probably I something think... that'll benefit him. So. Yeah. Give him like sturdy. Dirty would be good for the fire rock type. Yeah. Alright, uh, Jinko, you're up. Um, hold on, I'm trying to figure out an ability. Alright. Uh, wait for me, I'm not done yet either. Alright, good thing we're on Jinko. Uh, and then there's Lagoon. Well, yeah, but Lagoon's yeah. gonna go, like, Lagoon's after Jinko. So. Mega Liner. Um, okay. Mega, Mega, Mega Infernape. Well, oh. Mega's evolved the fourth gen starters, but Mega Infernape especially. Alright. And it would be cool if it got a drop in special attack, 
and then an increase in physical attack and speed. And maybe some defense in there. What about and that special then, defense? I don't, I don't know. Sure, why not, right? Like, five <laughs> points in special defense. Yeah. <laughs> um, and then... Trying to think of an ability. Well, it already has Blaze and Iron Fist. Yeah. To be honest, Iron Fist is still not a bad ability at all. It's yeah. not. Especially if you, like, give it, like, all... Because it can learn all the elemental punches, right? Yeah, oh, except for Ice, I think. Well, yeah, it's made out of fire, so... Yeah, exactly. I think for Alligator should learn Drain Punch, too. I feel like that would just help it out even more. Well, wouldn't that ruin the Shear Force, technically? Like, the no, you get no health out of that one, yeah? I guess so. Well, I'm just saying if you want to keep the Iron Fist around. It'd be interesting if you gave it, like, something you would never expect, like Regenerator. Or what? Let's give it Parental Bond. T yeah. Why? Not. Why not? <laughs> <laughs> Alright. I uh, got one, by the way. Mega Infernape with Parental Bond. Ooh. To make it happen. Alright, Lagoon, you're up. Oh, duh. Alright, I'm gonna go back to Gen 1. I want Mega Rapid Ash. Mega Rapid Ash. That wouldn't be bad. Yeah, right. it's gonna be turned into a Fire Fairy. Oh? It's gonna gain the Pixelate ability. Oh? It's gonna sure. get faster and have more special attack. Oh. Uh, all right, well, it's gonna grow wings. Yeah. If it it's a Pegasus. I, why not give it fly? <laughs> <laughs> why can't Rapid Rapid Ash is gonna learn fly? Rapid Ash can learn bounce. What if Rapid Ash is need the pop? What if it could learn fly, game? but it could only use it if it was in Mega? <laughs> Permanent Mega. Uh, but Rapid Ash's lowest uh stat is its HP. It has like no defense at all. So. Oh no, Lagoon. So you're sticking with just special attack and speed? You would raise nothing else? <laughs> well, you can't rage mode. HP, so... Oh, by the way... Oh, also lower know... attack. By the way, did you know that... Did you know that Rapidash has Flash Fire, Flame Body, and Runaway? I'm assuming you would keep Runaway, right? No, we're going Pixelite. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right, I forgot you said that. Alright, well... Uh, it's gonna learn fairy type moves. Okay. Lightning, your turn. I got luck, sorry. Oh, okay. I even made the stats too. 80 HP, a 20 drop in attack, so instead of 120, it'd be 100. Okay. 99 defense, 125 special attack, 109 special defense, and 110 speed. Intimidate Ooh. electric dark. Oh, man. You, you, it gets uh, dark pulse. Edgy. You keep it with a tip. You, you keep intimidate on it? Yeah, dude, that'd be so bulky with 109 special defense and 99 defense with intimidate. And have it have good special attack, because it has a good special move pool, in a way. I mean, I don't think it would be that bad. I'd see it being viable. Yeah. So I'm looking at Luxury's page right now, I was looking at the TMs it can learn. Did you know there's a TM100 and it's confide? Yep. Yeah. I yeah. did not know that was a thing. Why? Did you even play X and Y, nerd? I don't remember it. I mean, its physical move pool isn't bad either, but I think special is okay. Yeah. Get signal beam? Oh, that'd be so cool. Alright, well, but... for mine, I'm gonna go Gen 1. Kinda like Lagoon. I'm gonna go with Lapras. Alright. Cause I think Lapras is pretty neat. That's it. But no, uh... Hold on, I have to pull up Lapras' stats so too he's looking at Confide. Anyway. Uh, so Lapras, uh, right now, has 130 HP, 85 attack, 80 defense, 85 special attack, 95 special defense, and 60 speed. I definitely raise its speed and its special attack, maybe more- and definitely its defense and special defense, and I'd keep its attack as it is. Uh, maybe even lower its attack, so I can add more, uh, special attack and defense and all that. And I'd have it keep, uh, shell armor. And I think I'd make it, um, uh, ice dragon. Cool. So I think that would be pretty interesting, especially for because Lapras is pretty cool. I I think we can all agree on that. That's pretty neat. Yeah, and I think there should be more ice dragons besides a legendary. Yeah, especially because Kurum is booty. Yeah, there's other forms. Well, yeah, that's true, but regular Kurum. Okay. Are we done with that? 
Uh, I think so. Does anyone, else, does anyone else have anything to add about Mega Evolutions that they want to see? You can add any more if you really want. If you Mega want Spinda! Ask. No! <laughs> Mega Porygon Z would legitimately be cool. Normal electric or something. That would be broken. A Mega Golduck, Water Psychic. Spin, does, spin has 60 stats across the board. Everything's 60. Yeah. Mega Cast Form. <laughs> Sounds Mega really Cast Form! form. Alright, anyway, um, so... Castor's Since this is our first Pokemon. episode with guests, uh, what we're gonna do in a review of a guest is that we're gonna have um, we're gonna discuss some stuff that's based on the guest. So since Jinko is one of our guests, we're gonna discuss cast form. Yes. Uh, all right. Don't worry, Lenny. We'll get to you next. Uh, so guys, what is your favorite form of cast form? The one with the titties. <laughs> the one with the ball sack. What about you, every, Jika? Every one of them is good and amazing in their own ways, but I think normal cast form is the best. I like snow cast form. He's pretty I go chill. Love He's I like pretty water cool one. out here. I like the water one. The water one's drippy. I think there should be, like, a ground or a rock type one, because of sandstorm. sandstorm. That'd be pretty cool. But then, but, like, I, the... Cast Form's movesets are usually three weather moves and then weather ball. Yeah. Exactly. Oh. Well, some, sometimes people like to run different sets. Although Why not just speed. increase the, the power of weather ball to like 150? Although speaking of new weather, like what if there was new weather that could be in the battles? Oh, like in Gen 7? Yeah. What, what if it's a tornado? Was... Tornado! Wind! Wind. It's so windy. Overpowered in <laughs> it wind. increases, uh... Flying attacks. I feel like that, I feel like if it was like wind, if they added like that kind of a weather thing, it would kind of just be like a permanent tailwind. Oh no! Oh, be what would be the, be the point of that if it makes stadium. everything the same? Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah. I or feel maybe like they already introduced like some new weather. If you want to count like heavy rain, heavy sun. Yeah, but that's only for one thing. What and about electric stream. terrain? <laughs> Grassy oh, terrain. terrain. Misty terrain. Grassy terrain. Fairy lock, or whatever the hell it was called <laughs> with Clef Clefkey's move. Like, when, I, when I was battling Clement in X and Y, and they, he's pulled out electric terrain, I was like, what is happening? Because I had no idea what What does that even on. do? Uh, does it just boost electric type it moves? It boosts electric type moves, and nothing can fall asleep. What? Why Why can nothing fall asleep? Because everything's electrified. No, stop. <laughs> Hyper. Okay. Uh, so anything? So, uh, Jinko, do you have any words about cast form you want to share with the audience? Um, hold on. I wrote some. I wrote something down. Did you actually? This... All right. I'm ready. Are you ready? I'm, yeah, I'm ready. ready. Cast form is an artificial Pokemon okay, that changes appearance and attitude based on the weather. Its body is made of cells exactly like those of water molecules, Hi. causing its cel cellular stru <laughs> structure to be altered by temperature and humidity. It uses the ability to protect its tiny body. In its normal form, it resembles a plain gray cloud with a single wisp extending from the top of its head. When it is in sunny he form, its lower this. half becomes pure white while it, <laughs> it turns orange and <laughs> develops a small orange spheres around it. This gives the overall appearance of the sun above a small cloud. While it's in rain form, it will have a dark gray lower half Why are you so going? resembling a storm cloud. He didn't write this. This is the Bulbapedia thingy. The head will be blue and resemble a raindrop. And in snowy form, its head turns purplish blue. The rest of its body changes into the shape of a mint green. Come on, Limbus cloud. Call Nimbus? Call Nimbus. Regardless of the form it takes, it will always have a large... Oh, have a large spherical head and a lighter colored mask marking over its eyes. Aside from its various forms, That's Cast Form is able to oh, utilize weather powers in the form of its previously signature move, Weather Ball. Despite its man made origins, it can be found in grassland areas. Okay, good, we're done. Alright, um. Can I get two topics? And furthermore. <laughs> Alright, well, can anyway, I get two uh, topics? Um, well, so in case you guys don't know, uh, Lightning is a master at nicknaming oh, Pokemon. Oh, yes. No. Um, Jinko, uh, Jinko, would you like to give us some examples of some of his names? Hold the on. Soul, like, you, Let me Sir, pull it up real did? quick. So, Jinko, Lightning, and Sir, please stop that he's Soul Link a while back. And some of, uh, some of the, some of Lightning's names are a bit iffy. All right. Yeah, like Jump Woman. 
<laughs> well, that's one. Well, let's not, let's not some of your favorites, Jinko. Alright, one of my favorites was probably Ouch My Foot. <laughs> that was Eradicate. <laughs> don't forget Ninja Ask, don't forget Ninja Ask. Wait, wait, what was Ninja? Oh, yeah. Fuck, I fell! Fuck, I fell the Ninja Ask. <laughs> what about Dragon? Um, yeah, he had a Rayquaza named Dragon. <laughs> what the fuck? Don't he had a Pidgeotto named Big City Boy. <laughs> Salamence? And probably my personal favorite, favorite, he had a Natu named Voos. <laughs> Why? Oh, oh also he had an Oddish, he had an Oddish named Jump Woman. What my about favorite. Salamence? Oh yeah, Salamence was named Dimpoi. Dimpoi, comma, comma, period, period. Oh yeah. The exact. My favorite, one was, my favorite one was Angry Girl, the Grumpy, the Grand, the Grand Bull. <laughs> or Tough Boy, the Lara. What about Zany Zack? That's Sand Shrew. Oh yeah, you right. could have used Zany like Zag or something. Lightning, we need to do a Soul Link. Mm, yeah, I got some Don't do a Soul Link with Lightning, he'll lose everything. I'm doing one with Lightning right now, we have to, fit, we have to continue that. Yeah, we have to continue eventually. Why was your Skarmory named CJ? Why not? Alright, anyway. So we're gonna, I... play, we're gonna play a little game with you, uh, Lightning. I'm gonna name a Pokemon, I want you to nickname it on the spot. Oh god. <laughs> That's right. normally what I do, so I'm good at this. Alright, you ready? Yeah. <laughs> Ursa Ring. I uh, lick talk. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Uh, Not happy right now. <laughs> uh, Cubone. <laughs> Germ napkin. <laughs> <laughs> Did you say germ napkin? <laughs> oh dear. Alright, um okay. We should have everyone we should have everyone. Swablu do a dead nickname. pony. <laughs> no, why? <laughs> Alright, yeah, everyone Jinko? Yeah, let's have everyone go. Alright, now we're gonna so Ixo, you ready? Oh no. Absol. Oh. Pandora. Alright, Jinko, you have Ambipom. Mild sauce. <laughs> Lagoon, you have Cascoon. Castration. <laughs> Lightning, you have Durant. Fresh tangerine. And Lego, you, you have, have Reggie Rock. One night, ultimate werewolf. Okay. Do one right, more. Um, okay. Ixo, you have Jigglypuff. Squeeze me. <laughs> <laughs> Jinko? Mantine? Mild sauce. <laughs> <laughs> I know what's written here. Lagoon, you have... Hold on. Trevenant. Spooky, scary skeletons. No, that's not okay. And Lightning, you have... Scatterbug. I lost my dog! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's do one more go around. Uh, Ixo, wait, like, like, wait. What? You have to do one. Oh, yeah. You have Lucario. Permanent marker. Alright, Ixo, you have Emolga. Kill me now. <laughs> Jinko. Jinko. Jinko, you have Servine. Mild sauce. <laughs> Lagoon? Luminion. WHERE ARE MY FRUIT LOOPS?! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, and Lightning. Lightning, finish us off with... Tropius. <laughs> baby... Baby... <laughs> baby mix cheddar cheese. What? what? Baby mix cheddar cheese. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now all Lego. Lego, you have Whiskash. Oh. Verde. Okay. All right, and now all of us, and all of us, we're all gonna do one together. We're all gonna have the same one. Are you ready? Ella kid. Mild Fuck. sauce. Fat idiot kid. <laughs> plug me in, daddy. Ch oh Lagoon. no, plug hole. Stick a fork <laughs> into an outlet, please. Toaster boy. 
germy phobe. <laughs> All right. Uh, thanks for watching the podcast, everyone. Wait, uh, wait, wait, hold on. Wait, what about what? Flippo Dip XD? Who is that, Jinko? What? Flippo Dip XD? I don't like you. Who is that again? I don't care. You should. <laughs> wait, hold on, wait, Lightning. I don't have the doc open, but I had something named Flippo Dip XD. Wait, Lightning. Let's do, let's do, uh, I want you to do one more thing for us before we end this up. I want you to name one of the, one of the names you gave your Pokemon, and then I want to, and then I want to guess what it was. Um, hmm. can I have my doc, Jinko? Okay. Give him the doc, give him the doc. Don't send it in this TSO, so it's private. Message we're gonna, me. we're gonna do some quick elevator music. La da 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 dee, la da 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 la da 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 Lightning! Hold on, stop! You're grounded for 4, 4, 5, 6, 7, 9, 2, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, Alright, so if you can... You can guess what was named D D D D D D D L L L F. I'll give you a million bucks. D D D D D D D L L L F. All right, Ixo, you go first. Uh, that sounds like a Venusaur to me. You're wrong. Lagoon. Uh, hmm. Yeah, Mega. No. Is it a bug? I'm going, with, I'm going with Yanma. Holy shit! Let go. No, you cheated. You cheated. You How did cheated. I cheat? You cheated. It's a Yanma. Fuck off. How did I cheat? It's a Yanma. Shout out to Jinko. Uh, he already well, he already knows. He sent me the dog. Alright, we'll do one more. Alright, one you more, cheated. one more, one more. I, I, well, I, I won't guess this time. I won't guess. Uh, no, you can guess. Okay. You cheated, though. What? How did I cheat? Alright, uh... Jane Apple. Oh, I know this one, so I'm not gonna guess. Wait, what is it? Jane Apple. So you wanna you wanna lay down? God, I guess? just broke the dock. Oh, Wiggly Tough. Uh, nope. Lagoon. It's the last thing you'd expect. I'm pretty uh, sure it was a boy. Last thing I expect. Was it a uh, ten growth? No. That's that's the first thing I'd expect. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go with the. I'm gonna go with the gay ass Feebass. Mm, no, it was an electric. It was a boy too. <laughs> I love electric. Hold on, I, guys. I just thought of a, a a move from the earlier segment. Oh my god, Jinko! That I would want to be added. I what? would want uh something. It, it would be like Forest Curse, but it would be for a uh, normal type. What is Forest Curse do? It gives the Pokemon grass type. Oh, oh yeah, that's right. Isn't there already one for normal or no? Is there? I don't know. But oh wait, no, I want it for I want it for bug type. Be called mosquito bite. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Is there a mosquito Pokemon? Is there? Probably no. not. Alright, how about this? We can do one more. <laughs> yeah, there's one more. Drill. one more what? One more Pokemon to guess the name. Alright. Third you, time's a charm. If you can guess what Zaframapig Zaframapag is, that's a billion bucks. Zaframapag? Yeah. Zeb Striker. It was a Gen 3 game. No. Oh, I guess I'm out. You can, so, you can do another guess. Uh. Flygon. No. Dude, that's Die. a gulpin all the way. Not a gulpin. Lagoon. Um. Swalot. No, it's a GTD. Alright, uh, before we finish this off, uh, Lightning, I want- Lightning, what would you name a Monferno? A Monferno? Yeah. Horn Chip. <laughs> Thanks. No problem, Jim. Right, mild Sauce. <laughs> mild, mild Sauce. Mild Sauce. <laughs> wasn't Mild Sauce the name of your Barboche? It was- yeah, it was a Barboche. And then Lightning killed it. Lightning killed it. You killed. Yeah, I saw the end somehow lost to Salamence. It was the, it was the only it was the only thing Jinko lost. It was the only thing. Cause I had a bulky team. All right, so is that it? No, the yeah, only I thing have... I lost was uh, so... what's it called? A machop thing. thingy. Yeah, it was a machop. All right, so are we done? Yeah. So uh, thanks guys for watching. Uh, thank you for Lightning and Jinko for guesting today. Die. Well, I'm right. sitting. <laughs> YouTube.com slash user slash oh! 22MC. YouTube.com slash user slash Invader 22MC. Why are you playing oh, the Vader's channel? I thought you put it in your channel.
Why did uh, you uh, If you guys haven't already, make sure to watch Total Drama Island. Oh, yeah, on Grant's uh, channel. Yeah, alright. Okay. Do that. Uh, so, yeah. Wait, one second. Uh, if you want a guest, make sure just to shoot uh, either me, Lagoon, J Lang, or XOPM. Again, probably not Lagoon. So Subscribe to the channel U C R U A G S Z H G U S N U Z K U V P S H P 6 Q. Who is that? Me. <laughs> I don't think that's you. www.youtube.com slash user slash legobeast68. That's not my YouTube. More like it's, Mr. it's Mr. Lego Beast. Oh, right. I thought we were for Lego's, Lego's Kitchen Cooks. next week. No, it's not. Don't get their hopes up. Alright. Uh, it's the Lego's Twitter for cringe. <laughs> See you guys next week. Uh.